What's going on, vloggers, bloggers, everyday toilet users? It's time for another episode of the Toilet Vlog. We're gonna be going. Bleh, we're gonna be doing a kitchen edition again, but today we're going to be making Chicago dogs. So we got some stadium hot dog buns from Aunt Millie, the company I work from. So, I know you're usually supposed to use, like, a traditional style, like, you know, like, poppy seed bun, but I couldn't find one. You know, so, sorry. <laughs> but, <laughs> we got all of our stuff laid out here. So, what I usually like to do when I'm constructing my Chicago dog is that I usually like to put down the relish first. So this is dill relish. It's not like the nice green, like neon green kosher relish that you would normally get. But if you're in a pinch, this will totally work. So, cut relish down. And then, what I usually do is I like, I take my, uh, my tomato, put it, on the, put it on the side, try to slice your tomato a little thin. And then, after that, I'm going to do my onions. I like red onions for when I'm doing my Chicago dog. I mean, everybody's different when it really comes down to it. So, you know, put a little couple in there. And this is all before we actually put down the actual dog itself. Everything like that. It's just kind of easier that way, to be honest. So at that point, now that we've got our, like, our spread kind of going on, this is when I put down the, the mustard. Yep, regular French's mustard. So, oh, one of those crusties just fell off. So then your mustard down. And then I do, this is an all beef hot dog. And then after that, that's when I put my sport peppers down. So two sport, two, juice is flying all over the place. And then after you, what I usually do is I take like a full pickle spear and I cut it in half. So now you can see that is a full Chicago dog. So you've got your tomato, your onion, your relish, your mustard. Um, the only other thing that you really be putting on this is celery salt, but I don't have any of that right now. I have regular, like, kosher salt, but, you know, I mean, it's, it's, you don't really need, there's enough sodium in this to begin with. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. But, yeah, there you go. That is your regular, traditional style Chicago dog there, other than it being on, like, a poppy seed bun and everything like that. I'm going to make a couple of these tonight. You know, I just got to get rid of the rest of the, the you got to make sure it's like an all beef hot dog when it really comes down to it. But yeah, it's it's super easy. You can get any of this stuff at a grocery store. I got all this stuff at Walmart, other than like you know the the regular dill relish and like the really nice relish that you can get from other stores. And you really just got to go to like a specialty store or something like that to get it. But it's it's like this almost like it's like green green. Like what could I say? No, it's like, it's blue, um, the relish. Like the Chicago blue relish. <laughs> but like, yeah, like I said, you gotta go to, kind of to like a specialty store or something like that. But yeah, there you go. It's super easy to make, and these are delicious. And, well, for me, I mean, personally, my favorite dog is a Chicago dog. Either way, it's that easy. And you can pick all this stuff up at Walmart for like, probably about 20 bucks. You know? Alright. Thanks for watching.